I'm Susan Koenig and this is Somatics for You. Today I'm going to do a movement called the twist. It comes right out of the Somatics book and it's part of the daily cat routine and this is cat routine number five. I've done another video of the twist with one variation and today's video is a second version of the twist with an additional variation. So first you go ahead and lie down comfortably with your knees bent and your arms out from your shoulders and you start by doing the normal cat five twist. So my knees and face are opposite, one arm is rolling up, that's the arm that the nose is facing, one arm is rolling down, that's where the knees are facing. And you just do as many repetitions as is comfortable. And you notice how you feel and what your level of ease is and comfort. And then you come to a resting point. You can certainly rest if you want. And then once again, bend your knees. And this time, you're going to go ahead and bring your knees and nose in the opposite direction, but now you're going to laterally flex or hike one hip and then hike the other hip. So in this rotated position, right now I'm hiking my left hip, my left pelvis towards my left armpit, and then I come through neutral and now I'm hiking my right hip towards my right armpit and I'm allowing my head and neck to roll gently as is dictated by the movements coming from my pelvis and my low back. And you just do maybe about three sets of this movement and then bring your knees back to center. If you need to rest with your legs straight, that's fine. And then you're going to rotate your uh, lower body in the opposite direction, face and knees opposite, and now once again in this rotation, you're going to hike one hip and then the other. So I am hiking my right hip, the right side of my body is shortening, my head naturally rolls to the right, and now I'm shortening the left side of my body my head is naturally rotating somewhat to the left. And I go back and forth, staying in my comfort zone, about three sets. Then I bring my knees back to center. Again, you can always rest. And now I'm going to go back and I'm going to do the twist and see how it feels. Nose and knees in one direction and then the other, one arm rolling up, one arm rolling down. You're getting the rotation not only in the arms but through the shoulders and shoulder blades. And you're seeing if the variation has made a difference in your ability to do the movement with ease and grace as well as perhaps gain some in the range of the movement you're doing. But number one, you always stay in your comfort zone. Come to rest. It's always nice to take a few seconds to rest. I hope you try this movement. These variations on the twist from this video and another video are wonderful additions to your daily routine. Thank you very much.